Push it through. No rush. It's coming. Push, push, push. And it's shake it out. If you shake it, shake it. Like, uh, uh, uh. All right. All right, Tyra. Very nice. This bag it's by a designer by the name of Foley and Karina now this bag is not cheap but it's two in one it retails for four hundred and eighty five dollars okay you can take it from day to night there's the suede side which she just showed suede is really big this fall we're seeing a lot of interesting textures and nice hardware so this works day to night again not cheap remember it's two bags and you look great thank you Quentin in our Tyra Show confession booth telling us how much his wife Ashley needed help. So this is uh, what Ashley looked like before with the sweet accent from Alabama. And then I brought her out to the Fashion Fix New Jersey truck outside. So come on out here, Ashley. Let's see the transformation. Stomach's gone. You look fabulous. What do you think she looks? How do you look? Like this? Awesome. Thank you so much. Let's pick some hair. Look at her hair. Makeup. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I go home with that. Well, I really wanted you to be sexy to feel your sexiness. So we filled your hair with loose curls, and you know we made your makeup sensual. We gave you gloss on your lips, and I love a smoky eye. They gave you a smoky eye, and the draping on the dress hides all the stuff that that we're gonna get rid of later. But you know you just had a baby. It's okay. It's okay to have this. You just had a baby. So the draping, you know, it breaks all that up. All right. So you look good. I'm loving the shoe. I'm loving this pearl bracelet with the little charms on it and this is hot you guys isn't this little wristlet hot it's like a snakeskin wristlet you see that it's hot. and you know what it's hot and everybody in the audience is going home with this snakeskin <laughs> And it's gorgeous, and y'all are all going home with it. And I know Alabama's going, I want one, too! <laughs> okay, so I'm sure you guys have seen the trucks where they're parked on streets. A lot of the times they're near construction sites, and you can get hot dogs, you can get burritos, you can get greasy tacos, you can get nachos. They're like the junk food trucks, but, ooh, it tastes so, so good. Here, Holly says that she is a junk food truck junkie. So, tell me why you like eating on the street and in the junk food trucks. It's like the best thing in the world. You wouldn't even believe it. Like, I'm from New York and I grew up in New York, so I've been eating off these trucks since I was in junior high. And it's like restaurant on wheels. What was your favorite thing back in the day to get? I would definitely have to say, like, the halal food. It's like the, the chicken and lamb with the rice uh -huh. and the white sauce. I have no idea what the white sauce is, but I know it's good. <laughs> what about your friends? <laughs> tell them that you want to take them to the trucks. They eat. think it's disgusting. I couldn't even pay them to eat from the truck. They really? think they say it's dirty. I don't understand how you can eat them there. I'm like, yeah, I don't understand. It's like the best food yes. in the world. But now it's taking it to the next level. I'm sure you've heard of the gourmet yes, food yes, trucks. Yes, yes, I have. Right? They're all yes. over New York City. I'm sure they're spreading across the country. But now you can get the high-class food on the trucks. And Holly and I are going to prove it. We're both foodies, right? Yes, Let's that's do fine. this. We're going to teach you how you can eat high, high, high-class food for on the screen of New York City. We're gonna start with an appetizer, then we're gonna do a main course, and then we're gonna go do dessert. So come on down here. Hi. Hey. So this is the Rickshaw Dumpling Truck. Have you been to the Rickshaw Dumpling Bar, the, no, the restaurant? No, I have not. These, are, these dumplings are uh, amazing, amazing. Some of the best in all of New York City. I'm obsessed with dumplings. Hello, hey, Katie. Hey, how you doing? 
you doing? Hi. Hey, Do you know coming. I've been to your store? I've been and you have. I sure have, oh honey. Gosh. The one on Twenty Third Street. On Twenty Third Street. But I didn't know that you had a truck. So we have a truck now. How long have you had this truck? We've had the truck since last September, so a little under a year. We're coming on our one year anniversary. I hear that you love dumplings. How many dumplings can you eat in a day? Oh my gosh, you know what? I eat so many dumplings. It's embarrassing. But the record is forty. I've had forty, 40 in, in one day. day. Okay, can we start with tasting? Because you're going to be our appetizer. Yeah. Absolutely. We have three different types of dumplings on the truck, and um, the first one here is the chicken and Thai basil dumpling, and it comes with a spicy peanut dipping sauce. And you guys can either grab chopsticks or just use your hands. Oh my god, I love the chopsticks. Isn't it so cute there. Do you use chopsticks, Holly? I have no idea how to use them, but I've always wanted to. Use them. <laughs> okay, we're gonna here try. Is the chicken and Thai basil. One. The sauce is a little kind of coming out, but okay, that's one yes. right there. The sauce is spilling a little bit. Okay. So Hi. let's see if you can do it for the first time. Just stab it. Yeah, there, you oh, there you go. There you go. I got it. <laughs> Chicken and what? The chicken and Thai basil. Oh, it's made with oh chicken, fresh Thai basil. Oh, it tastes so and high in. Spicy peanut dipping sauce. Mm, I'll put that back. Let's taste another one. Okay. Oh, it's really good. What do you think? Out? I love it. Oh, Anita delicious. Lowe is our chef. She was actually just recent on Top Chef Masters. Mm. Actually. This one looks healthy. This one looks like this wheat. This is a whole wheat wrapper, and it's whole and pureed edamame inside it. It's actually vegan as well. You know edamame, like the little soybeans and the mm. Japanese restaurant? the employee's favorite on the truck. It's good. I like this one. I like that one. <laughs> you want to finish that one? I like that one. And then the last one we have for you is the uh, pork and Chinese chai. I love me some pork. Do pork? I'm from the South. I okay. love pork. So many people don't eat pork. <laughs> Like in the bottom of the thing, it kind of spilled. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's sop up some of the spill. That's how street food should be, a little bit messy, you oh, know? Mm. Mm. That's kind of like the classic Chinese one. Yeah. Really good. We're going to move on to the entree now. You got it. I think I know what my favorite is, but we're not going to tell them. Yeah. Do you have a favorite? <laughs> I do. Okay, let's leave the chopsticks. Come on down. This is Thanks. fun. I like this. This is, how do you pronounce this? Is it Le Gamin or Le Gamin? Le Gamin. Le Gamin. Le Gamin. Le Gamin. Le Gamin. Truck. 1990, uh, no, last year. Last year? Yes. I and started. why did you decide to do a truck? Well, I had a restaurant and then, you know, I lost the lease because the rent became too expensive. So expensive. So the truck idea became a uh, reality. And what will we, we be testing today? You'll be testing a uh, lamb dog, which is a Moroccan spicy sausage, uh, a chicken, goat cheese, and tomato salad sandwich. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, Nutella banana. Let's do this one first. Yeah. So this yeah. is a lamb dog. Lamb dog. You said that you like lamb from the halal truck. Yes. Let's it's see it. if you like lamb from the um, le gamin. Le gamin. Le gamin. Le gamin. Oh, bon. No. no. Caramelized onion. Mm. What? Dijon okay. Mustard. High and hot dog. That's right. Oh, good. All right. What well, one? You hear that? Chicken, tomato, goat cheese, and salad. Chicken, tomato, goat cheese. Oh, look how high in this looks. Guys, this looks like an expensive restaurant. In the street. I still got yeah, the like lamb in my mouth. $8.50, I think. $8? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Good. Good. Now it's all mixing in my mouth. I have like the right. lamb dog still in my mouth. Yeah. Goat cheese and everything. <laughs> Okay. And a Nutella banana crepe. Yeah. Mm, I don't like chocolate, yeah. so you eat this one. I'll feed you. You don't okay. like chocolate? I don't like chocolate. Oh. Oh, well, that's it. This is good. Oh, you like that one. Okay, that's we're going to move on to dessert. That was like right a little then. bit of dessert, but we're going to go to the dessert truck. See you later. Merci beaucoup. Bye-bye. I'll teach you later. A plus. Okay, now we're going to go get some dessert. That's good. That's a little delicious. delicious.